Hello everyone, in today's video I'm just going to show you a very quick, uh, short and sweet way to connect to your MiFi device. A lot of our Huawei router devices also have the feature. It is the WPS connectivity system and instead of trying to log on to your MiFi device or your router device and punch in the generic complicated password of capital letters, small letters, numbers. Uh, there's a very short and sweet way to do it by just holding in the WPS button on your devices, connecting to the Wi-Fi from your laptop system. Uh, our quick setup today is we're using a laptop with Windows 10 on it and we've got the Huawei E5885 device in front of us here. We're all set up to go, we've got a SIM card in it, everything's powered on and I'm just going to show you very quickly how to connect to the, the Wi-Fi without punching in all of those um, lowercase and higher case numbers. So here we go. All we need to do is once we've got both devices on in Windows 10, we want to scroll down to our Wi-Fi symbol in the bottom right hand corner. You can find this close to where it tells you the time and date. Uh, we want to click on it and this will bring up uh, a list of the different uh, Wi-Fi networks in our area. Uh, we're going to find the SSID of our E5885 and we'll scroll down to our Huawei CBFO SSID. We're going to click on that. In this instance, I'm not going to collect, connect automatically. Uh, if you would like it to connect to the Wi-Fi SSID in the future automatically, you're welcome to click that option. We're going to click connect and then just before we type in our Wi-Fi key, just underneath that on Windows 10, it's going to give you the option of pressing that button on the router, in this case the WPS button. So on the 5885, uh, it has a WPS button on the top right hand corner over here. I'm going to hold that in until I see the WPS symbol come up. There it is over there, so it's letting me know that's activated. And on our screen, it will say that it's busy retrieving the password settings from the device, and our laptop is now connected, as we can see on the top, top corner of our SSID list. Uh, and then you're good to go. You're connected to the E5885, and now you're connected to the web, so you're all good to go. Thank you very much.